Hello everyone, this is Nathan Bryan, and this is update number 48 of Loxo the Elephant. Today, I uh, broke down all of the stepped poses and pushed them into spine. spline. Um, this is a smooth conversion from pose to pose. Uh, you'll notice that certain things, they look much more realistic, and those were the things I concentrated most on in the blocking stage. And then other things are still a little um, uh, off in their timing. Uh, those things I'll be working on from here on in, uh, as well as fixing up the rigs. I noticed that the rigs had some problems with the noses, as I had expected. And going into spline really brought those out. Um, I have fixed Loxo's nose, uh, so you'll see a huge difference compared to Loxo and Betty. Um, Betty's is still broken and will be fixed tomorrow. Um, you'll see that you know at certain places there's some weird flipping things going on uh, that has been fixed in Loxo. I also uh, timed out the feet because going into spline is the perfect time to you know make sure that every time the feet move they actually lift off the ground. So I've got a little bit of that. I still need to make sure that the arcs in the feet are working as well as the rest of the body. And there are also a couple of poses which I'm noticing they go a little fast, like from there to there. So from here on in, it's all timing. Uh, still haven't quite gotten to working in the graph editor. Right now is pretty strictly you know, sticking to the poses, making sure the timing is correct. It's a little easier to see in spline after you've gotten the poses downed, down and blocked. So there you have it. That's my update for today. Uh, with this, I'll include the video so you can check it out. Um, I hope everyone has a great afternoon and happy animating.